My name is Sean Ramirez. I am a producer. I've been producing for about four years. And today, I'm going to be taking one of my old beats and applying everything I've learned in the past three years of producing. And we're going to go from there. I uh, don't even know what to choose. Some of these names also are just... I also feel like a lot of these are just started and never finished. So... Um, and I probably don't have all the samples that I need, so it's gonna take me a minute. Let's choose, um... Let's go with... Un we'll do this. Exactly three years ago. Now bear in mind, I'm probably not gonna have anything for this. So, uh, yes, I need to save this. Really quick. It's probably going to show me a bunch of stuff that I don't have. Let me have to go and find it all. So, okay. So one thing I'm going to point out before we start this is one. I don't even know what's going on here. I had the fruity edition of FL studio back then. I hadn't paid for the producer edition yet. So you can't drag and drop samples in that. Like you can't just pull this out and put it here. And let that like play it won't it won't load so a lot of these really oddly misplaced patterns are gonna be sounds that I had to throw into a pattern to a random pattern that just has like one sound on it right like this riser here this riser I'd have to put it there and then place the pattern in a way where the riser would actually hit when it was supposed to so just keep that in mind let's go <laughs> oh, painting. Painting. Let's start with uh, let's start with addressing the big issue here. I have two two bases. Hmm. I don't think both of these are necessary. So that's the 808. It's supposed to be a sort of counter melody to whatever this is. I really loved that painting, didn't I? Let's see that. Oh yeah, there it is. Look at this dude. <laughs> We're gonna just like, well, let's do the basses and then we'll do the melody. We're gonna adjust this counter melody. This is gonna be, uh, since we're starting with it, maybe this is the main melody. I don't, I don't even remember why it would make Oh, 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 never mind. I got it. I got it, I got it, I got it. Um, um, where's it at, where's it at, where's it at, winds. This needs to be like a, maybe this. Okay, we are adjusting this though, so it's not gonna be the same. I don't even know what key that's in. I don't even know, man. It doesn't. It just doesn't sound good. Let's 
give some depth to it. Actually, I'm surprised. It's not horrible. The reason I'm doing this is so I can make myself aware that I, I started <laughs> really, really, really bad. This way I'll feel more accomplished with my newer stuff because my newer stuff has gotten so much better recently. What's that sound like with everything else? feeling up on that yeah. going for the higher octaves we'll go for five okay and then clap we're gonna go eight to ten is that what's next this will be a direct comparison to the old one we're gonna start see <laughs> Oh, painting. Painting. Thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to drop a like subscribe and comment down below as i will be posting more of these beat making videos soon um if you have any suggestions any ways you think i can improve if you want to give me some uh, some you know tips thoughts if you want me to do another video like this where i go through and i redo an old beat or if you guys have old beats you want to send me and i can try them out let's 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 do it okay thank you